Hi guys, uh, just Gavin here. Um, so I just wanted to tell you a little story this week. Um, just about one of my friends actually, one of my close friends. Um, and somebody who um, goes through like, fluctuations of losing weight, gaining weight, losing weight, gaining weight, and so on. And probably since I've known him, this has happened uh, three or four times. Um, and you might be able to relate to that where you, you lose the same seven pounds or the same stone, whatever it is, and then uh, you regain that same amount, all right? Um, and the reason you might lose that amount, maybe because you've got an event coming up. For him, he's got a wedding uh, coming up soon, um, but it could be a holiday, anything like that. But it's very common for people to actually just lose weight, gain weight. Um, and that's all That's all well and fine if you're happy doing that, but there's a, something I think you should uh, consider if you've done this multiple times, okay? And what that is, is um, your fat cells and how this yo-yo um, actually affects your fat cells, all right? So if you think of this balloon as being one of your fat cells, and let's say it's the first time you gain uh, fat, okay? So let's talk about gaining fat, not so much gaining weight, but actually gaining fat. Okay, if that's the fat cell, first time you gain fat, Okay, that that fat that fat cell expands, and um, then you lose weight, and that fat cell deflates. <laughs> so it deflates, but it doesn't disappear. You can't destroy fat cells. All right. So what happens then is you regain weight again. So same fat cell, and then you lose it, and then it happens again. And then so on and so on. All right. Now, what you probably noticed there was each time I blew up the balloon, it became easier for me to blow it up. Okay. And that's the same as it happens to your fat cells. The more often that you lose weight and gain weight, the more, um, let's say, flexible your fat cells uh, become. All right. Or more stretchy. Um, so what I'm saying here is that um, the more often you do it, the uh, the easier it is to continually gain. Uh, weight, all right. Um, so that's something I think you should consider if you're always going through this fluctuation, uh, as opposed to making a commitment to longer-term sustainable change. All right, uh, and that's all.